Hi everyone. So I'm going to dip this real quick and then talk. Okay, so that is my last one of these. Um, so I, that's my last Wanfo, my last um, one at all. Um, I ordered some more this morning, but I thought that um, with the Amazon Prime, I thought that they came um, the next day and my husband said they come in two days. So I don't think I'll be getting them till Monday because um, tomorrow's Saturday. Yeah, so probably not on Easter. Um, that's fine, I guess. I still have my monitor. So it is cycle day 16 and I still am not getting, um, I still have not ovulated. Um, I think last month was cycle day 17 that I ovulated. So, but I, I mean, I don't even think that it's going to be tomorrow. Um, I'm having some like differences in signs. Like I am getting very pimply, which is a sign for me usually, but, um, other like cervical mucus signs are not completely there. Um, I don't know. So, um, I have, let's see, my monitor was, um, low, low, I think 11 and 12. And then it's been high 13, 14, 15, 16, whatever. I, anyway, it's been, it's been a couple days of highs. This morning was high, but when I looked at the stick, when I took it out, it looked different. Like the LH side was getting a little higher. So, or darker. So I thought, you know, I'll take my last one. So it's, I, t I waited a couple hours right now. It's like, I think it's 4.30 in the afternoon. And um, we'll see what this test looks like. So um, I didn't mention in my last, I meant to mention this in my last um, post. Um, I had, um, let's see, I had that, uh, my last, my first period after the DNC and polypectomy was horrible and I know I mentioned that horrible worst one I've ever had in my life well not in my pretty much in my life so um I was a little concerned but the last one I had right before this was like a lot better it was still heavy but not even nearly what it had been so I'm thinking that having that little piece of placenta and those polyps removed has helped with that um also Let's see what else. Oh, I had mentioned in, like probably two months ago on here something about losing weight, and um, lately I've been feeling it. Like I need to really get into it. Um, like my pants are tight, and they are like my biggest size. Like I think I weigh. I my scale isn't working real well. I think I need a new one. Um, the screen thing is broken. Like the numbers don't read good. So I don't know for sure. But holy crap, my pants are tight and I have gained a lot and I'm feeling it. So I stopped drinking pop at the beginning of this week. Um, and I stopped eating snacks like junk. Now I know there's a lot more I need to do than just that. Um, I haven't brought myself to exercise yet, but I'm going to get there. Um, so yeah, I, I need to do this. I need to, I need to do something. I've, I've just been, you know, in my own world and not really caring about losing weight that much, um, focused on other things. And, um, I'm sure it would help. Like, I think when I got pregnant last time I had just lost like 16 pounds or something. Um, so it always helps. And anyway, yeah, I just haven't been feeling like the, the ovulation coming like I normally do. So I'm not sure what this test is going to look like. I'm hoping it's positive, but We'll see. And actually, it's been like three minutes, so let's check. I'll just turn this up, this up here. Ah, come on, there we go. Okay. Ah, there we go. Now I think. Can you guys see it? I believe that that's positive. You think? Let me look at. The... Definitely. So there we go. I don't know why I haven't had any. Like you know, science down there, whatever, I guess that's fine. So I got my positive and now I should be ovulating in the next day or two. So, all right, well, I will make an update in a couple days and let you guys know what's going on.